I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. What's up, Broncos? So today I'm here with um, our very own uh, mayor, Mr. David Turner. How are you today, Mr. Turner? I'm doing well. That's Glad awesome. to be here. That's awesome. Um, just uh, one question, you know, is your position elected? My p position is elected. Uh, I'm elected every four years, but I can only serve two terms. So okay. I can only be in office eight years. So how long have you been serving? Been mayor for six years. Wow, that's I awesome. I have two more years and then somebody else's turn. Oh, wow, okay, that's so cool. So, um... What is it that you want to talk to us about today? We're here to talk about, it's called social hosting. Uh, what that means is we are trying to reduce the amount of young people who are drinking illegally. Uh, in the past, we've given the kids the tickets. Uh, if you were at a party and you were drinking and you got caught by the police, you got a minor in possession. Well, that really didn't work very well. Mm -hmm. So we have passed an ordinance, which is basically a law in the city. And now we're going after the parents. Uh, if there's a party at somebody's house and we find underage people drinking, we can give the parents up to a $2,000 oh, wow. ticket for hosting a party. Um, so let's say that it wasn't in a uh, household. Maybe mm -hmm. it was maybe at a shop or at a hotel room. How would that be mm -hmm. approached? Whoever rented that hotel room, because you have to be an adult to rent that, could they were the ones that are going to get the ticket. Oh, okay. So, um, you know, some hotels, you know, you got to be 18. Mm -hmm. So would it be those 18-year-olds that were, that are going to be charged for that? Yes, it would okay. be the 18-year-old. And if we can find out who supplied the alcohol, we're going to give them one too. Oh, okay. And we actually had one lady who got a felony last year. And she is probably going to do jail time because she bought alcohol for underage uh, young people. Oh, wow. That's, wow. It's crazy. Um, anything else you'd like to add on to this? Um... Well, we just want to say, especially to our seniors, congratulations. I know you've done a lot of hard work, and we're very excited. We're very excited that you're graduating. Uh, but as the city leaders, we just want you safe uh, and you to be a productive citizen here in Odessa. All right. Well, awesome. Thank you so much for coming out and, you know, uh, letting us know about this. Sure. And remember, guys, you know, don't risk this. You know, this is uh, not just you, you yourself. You're putting yourself in trouble. It's your parents as well. So watch out. Okay, I forgot my shirt. It's tight for graduation. It's two weeks. All right, dude. Well, you can go by this time in room 516 with Miss Eastep for $10. You can wear it at graduation. I don't know where you're going to get a shirt, but you got that. Do you like to dance? Do you like to perform? Come join the 2018-2019 Bronco Color Guard at the OHS Band Hall. Be sure to wear comfortable clothing and bring a friend. The clinic dates are May 7th, May 14th, May 21st from 6 to 8 p.m. As well as May 22nd from 6 to 8 p.m. The tryout day will be May 24th from 5 to 9. You will also have to have a $100 deposit on this day. No experience necessary. Students, if you have a textbook that you are no longer using, please turn it into the book room as soon as possible. Return your library books by May 11th and get a Jolly Rancher. Second <laughs> annual powerlifting dodgeball tournament is Wednesday, May 16th at the OHS gym. All students and organizations can play. To sign up, go to the athletic office or email melissa.smith at ectorcountyisd.org. Wishing a happy birthday to the following students.
You shared birthdays with this celebrity. That's it for today's Bronco News. Tune in tomorrow for more announcements.